So I wanted to tell you something I'm pretty excited about for all of you Mike Austin fans that's out there. This was really, uh, really exciting for me. For years, I've been looking to try to find a copy of Philip Reed's book, In Search of the Greatest Golf Swing. It's, uh, it's about Philip Reed's journey to go and meet Mike Austin and to start chronicling his life and to learn about this 515-yard drive that he hit. The book was originally published in 2004, uh, about a year or so before Mike Austin passed away. And I really wanted to get my hands on this book, but it was out of print. And it, the books that were for sale out there were going for well over $100. Well, I just recently did another search on Amazon looking to see, okay, what's out there about Mike Austin. And I found that the editor or the publisher has printed uh, a second edition of this book. They, they put it out in November of 2022. So it's fairly recently right now. It's the end of March in 2023. Um, and it's only $19.95 for the paperback. You can pay, I think, $38 something for the hardcover. Um, but this is really exciting. And if you want to get really inspired to go out and learn this swing and to perfect this swing so that you can hit the longest drives and most accurate drives of your life, you've got to read this book. It's really good. Another thing that it does is this book, uh, along with a lot of other evidence, but this book in particular uh, will put to bed a lot of the naysayers out there that talk about Mike Austin's claim to have hit a 515-yard drive. Well, the fact of the matter is Austin didn't come out and claim that himself. And he, didn't, he wasn't the one to come out and claim that it was in the Guinness Book of World Records. I've had people write me comments saying, oh, I've checked the Guinness Book of World Records. He's not in there. He's a liar. Well, he's not in the current book. Uh, Guinness Book of World Records, the online version, because they don't even have a category anymore in there for the longest drive hit in a regulation tournament. Um, but back when he accomplished this feat, and for many years after, in their print edition, it was included in the book. And as proof of this, the author, Philip Reed, he just happened on the first day that he went to meet Mike Austin, he took his printed copy of the Guinness Book of World Records because he wanted to get Mike Austin's signature on the same page that had the excerpt in it uh, talking about his feet. And it's, he, he made a picture of it right here in the book. And that's just a snapshot of the par partial excerpt from the book. It's, he, he puts the entire Guinness Book re, uh, recording uh, later on in the book. Another important thing is he went and visited Chandler Harper, who was Mike Austin's playing partner in the National Senior Open in Nevada, where Mike Austin hit this drive of 515 yards. So Philip Reed went and traveled and visited Harper Chandler and who was in his 80s when, when Philip Reed met him and interviewed him. And he put that interview in here. And he put, Charper, or put Harper Chandler's account of that day and that drive in the book. There were countless PGA official, officials around. There were other players around that saw this drive being hit. Um, there were spectators there. Guinness Book of World Record actually went to the location to verify it. They talked to many witnesses. So this isn't just some claim that Mike Austin suddenly came out of the woodwork and started claiming he hit this incredible drive. It was documented. There were witnesses. There were, in fact, in 2005, the Golf Channel even did a little piece on the 515-yard drive. So the naysayers out there that want to say it didn't happen, you go ahead and keep doubting. You keep trying to learn the conventional swing and keep trying to get distance however you seem right or however feels right to you. That's fine. But for those of you that want to learn the Mike Austin method, you've come to the right channel and I highly recommend you read this book. I'm going to put a link for it down in my description so you can go straight to Amazon and buy it. Um, it's just a great read. It's really neat to learn all the different things that Mike Austin accomplished in his life besides just that 515-yard drive and besides 
creating the best golf swing that the world has ever seen. So again, I recommend this book. Go ahead down in the description, click on it, go to Amazon, get your own copy before they're gone.